Hey guys, I'm Rachel, and in this tutorial, I'll teach you how to add the bokeh effect to any coloring using the Color Therapy app. The bokeh effect is a photography technique that creates a soft, out of focus background, which often includes circles of light or glowing orbs. It's most often seen at night with city lights, but can also be created during the day from the sun as well. So I recommend finding a reference first to help you get started. I'm going to use the one that has like the rainbow colors in it just because I like it. You can also do something like this where it's at night and the lights are shining through too. The next thing you want to do is find an image where your subject is in the foreground. So for example, I'm just going to choose this one bird here and then I'm going to put the aboka effect all throughout the background. So you want to color the entire background first and then color the foreground as the very final layer. Let's go ahead and open up the color palette and choose our colors. First, I would start off with a background color just for a foundation. So I'm going to use this pastel solid blue under the basic palette and then I'll just go ahead and tap it in. And then in that same palette, I'm going to grab a pastel lilac color as well as the green and then a pale yellow. And then under the glow palette, I'm also going to grab a basic orange. I think we also need a bright pink. So under the vibrant palette, I'm going to grab a bright pink. We also need some darker colors too. So under the dark shades palette, I'm going to use a dark purple as well as a dark green. And finally, just grab a basic white. Now let's first start off by making the background look really fuzzy and blended in. So let's go in the manual mode and select airbrush. Let's set the opacity to 25 and the size to 100. Make sure that coloring inside the lines mode is set to off. And then using all of those colors, I'm just going to start to begin to add it in really softly on the edges and just begin to blend those colors in. And I'm just blending in the entire background. And then you can also raise the opacity to 85 to really darken up those colors in a few areas. Now we're ready to add in the bokeh effect and we're going to use the pen tool and it's perfect for this because it has a perfect circle. Let's start with raising the size to 100 and the opacity to 15. Now I'm going to use all the colors that we chose and I'm just going to begin to make some spheres. Some of them are going to be bigger and some will just be smaller that I'll just tap with my finger. When you're making large spheres, begin by starting in the middle and working outward. Next, raise the opacity to 50% and do the same thing. Add in another layer. You also want to adjust the size, so make some of them a lot smaller and some a lot bigger. It's also good to just focus the spheres in one area in general. So for this, I'm leaving the corners untouched. It's also really good to blur some of the dots. So the way you can do that is by just tapping your finger and then just moving it slightly. And now you have blurred edges. So do that with some of them as well. Now continue adding in spheres until you've completed it. Vary the spheres by lowering or raising the opacity as well as changing the color. Make sure to overlap them too. The final step is to color in the bird, then finish by removing the lines. You can create this background on any image that contains an up close subject in the foreground. If you'd like to see more tutorials like this, don't forget to subscribe to the Color Therapy YouTube channel so you don't miss any new tutorial videos. Thanks for watching our tutorial. You can get the Color Therapy app for free on the App Store.